We're in Delta Terminal F. This is the biometric terminal. Here's how it works. You walk up to the kiosk. It captures your image right there, and then it immediately takes that photograph and compares it with your passport photo. If it matches, you're through. At the world's busiest airport, it's all about picking up the pace. Just stop right here. Take a look at the camera for me. Here you go. You have a great flight. Delta's International App Terminal, now the first in the country to go completely biometric, with facial recognition cameras replacing paper tickets and passports. <laughs> That's a horrible. It starts at the check in kiosk. The camera recognizes your face, compares it to your passport photo on file, and you're done. But don't forget your passport. You'll still need to show it at the gate to prove you have one, because when you get to your destination, they're going to want to see your passport. Hi, how are you? When you check your bag, the camera again verifies it's you. That's it? Perfect, that's it. Not just checking in and bag check, but come early next year, you'll be able to use your face as a boarding pass to get right through TSA. It's the same process when you get to the gate. The camera recognizes your face, and you're on the plane. It's just like a one step, you know, you don't have to go through the hassles and uh, it's very convenient. Homeland Security already uses facial recognition cameras for arriving and departing international passengers. But Delta is the first to add it to the entire check-in process, curb to gate, shaving nine minutes off the boarding time for an international flight. Next month, coming to Detroit's international flights and soon flights within the U.S. I think it's realistic to expect within the next couple of years to be able to experience this same benefit domestically as well. A slow rollout across the country as facial recognition comes to an airport near you. So here's how it works. This camera is actually taking a whole bunch of measurements of my face, the distance between my eyes, my nose, my ears, my mouth, the breadth and, and length of the, no and the nose and the face. And all of that is part of the measurements that they have on file. TSA and Homeland Security says it's 98% accurate. So no more digging through your pockets to get your passport or your ticket. Literally, look at the camera. And you're in. Right. Yeah. I like it. I guess there's something special if you have a twin. But That's other right. than that, you're okay, Tom. Thank you. Thanks, Tom.